Yes, sir. Gochi, this proposal will just not cut it. If we're asking people to give us their businesses to run, first of all, we need to show them that we're running ours right. This proposal does not do that. It makes us look incompetent. Rewrite it. Now, yes, Infinity called. They did not accept any of the candidates that we sent them, which means we have to run the vacuum group again. This time, please run them online as well because they want somebody in five days and we must deliver. Infinity has been with us for far too long. I do not want to disappoint. Okay. Um, yes, call GFR. I'll let them know somebody will be with them shortly to go over the business plan. Uh, please, ma'am, can I go get my name? No, Ngochi, I do not have time for that. Now, um, yes, what else? Yes, um, reschedule my two o'clock. I can't make it. I have to be in Abuja, which also means I cannot make the press conference for four. That means you have to attend it. If you can't, Ask one of the PR guys to do it. Okay, well. Uh, wait, um, yes. Let Tena know. Call her. I can't make lunch. Something came up. That's it. All right. Oh. Now that's what I'm talking about. That's a real woman. I'll give anything to bed that woman. Guy, are you out of your mind? Eh? How can you say such a thing? Make sure she never hears you, else she'll be dead with you. No, she doesn't bite. She just has a loud bark. And she needs a real man to tame her. And you think you're that man to tame her, right? Eh? Oh, I know that for a fact. It was revealed to me last night. Hmm. By dreaming or by your perfect imagination. Look. I do not wish to be part of this conversation right now, eh? Because when Yawa don't gas, I don't want me anybody mention my name for the matter. Stay here. Stay here. I was not here. Come on, come on. Come on. Hello, Ma. Oh, yes, Ma, I'll be there now. Oh my God. What are you all about today? Why? I think she heard us. Say last prayer. I think saying nothing. Uh, Ugo, remember to tell her that I wasn't part of the conversation. Me, me too. Hey, just go back. Go back. Shut up. Just go. Oh, you know what happened to Joseph? His dreams came true. Sarah, the next time you ask your PA to call me up and cancel lunch, I'll have your head for lunch. You know I can't stand that girl. Please, Diana, who can you stand? Besides, you forget that unlike you, some of us have to work. My sentiment exactly. Why do you have to work? You have all the money in the world, you have everything at your beck and call, and then you still want to work. I have told you so many times. I come from a family of self made people. I refuse to be the only one. Okay. Let me try. Are you buying a rookie's shape? It is so beautiful. It is green and gold. We have to go shopping for accessories. You have to buy this one because you can't wear your suit. Okay, but first of all, who is rookie? She was in her room now, 100 level. 100 level? No, no, and you still keep in touch with Rookie. You knew I was the patron now, eh? And I saw her there at the old school meeting. Uh, aren't you tired of buying Ashwin or attending all these old one bits? And how much is this Ashwin? Let me ask. 200k. What? 200? For what? Is Ashwin made of gold? Can it take dictations? Stop being so overly dramatic. I barely know Rookie and she wants 200k for me. You remember her? And she says she's giving us tabletop refrigerators as souvenirs. Tabletop refrigerators, is that your problem? Sweetie, can I buy you five so that we don't? All right, all right, all right, all right, Sarah. No need to be sarcastic, okay? We need to support her. She'd have seen her. You need to, Zara. We need to. I'm serious. <laughs> you gotta be kidding it's me. The best thing ever. <laughs> Hello, lovelies. Hello. Sorry, I'm late, Jerry. I did not want me to. Seriously, Sarah. 
You had a meeting on Sunday. And the hell for doing is the only day I could see the chap. It's the only day you've got to rest that. Leave her alone. The girl lost her job. That's because she's got no man to love. Uh uh. Has Mubi and I turned to dissing Zara night? Hello. Please, I'm hungry. Please eat. No one's dissing you, Zara. And Tena has a point. This is Naija. Society demands that you get married. <laughs> You're the only single left amongst us. Very soon you'll be president of the single thing. <laughs> <laughs> did you see your husband? Last week? Oh, uh, last month. Maybe last year. Please, my dear, don't count yourself as married. All right? They just wed you. Whatever. Zara, that was cold, Zara. What? She started it. Look, I don't have a boyfriend because I haven't found the right man for me. And contrary to traditional beliefs, my life is complete without a man. Thank what you. What about security? Can I enjoy this food in peace? Man shall not live by bread alone. Three, two. One, your friend. One, your friend. Press the door. Ha! Single two. <laughs> Okay, but I don't have that name on my list. Then you should check the next page. No, the one after that. Uh, let me call you the next one. I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't do it intentionally. I'm, I'm sorry. What time is my meeting with Miss Dandan? Um, um, it's in 45 minutes. And that's all the time you have to go to my house and get me change of clothes. Uh, I, I think I've had enough chews.
go to. You know, I admire you a lot. In fact, I envy you. I wish I had the job. To enter and re enter Zara's office would be so satisfying. Well, now you know what? You can have my job if you want to. But trust me, you would not last five minutes in that. Oh, but you're wrong, then. You see, she may sack me in the office, but she'd keep me in her bed forever. Well, yes. But you see, by the time I give her some darling sexual healing, you know, and, and my special move. I call it the special Danny Waste Breaker. Woo! She'll be keeping me in her bed forever. She'll be wanting more, you know. All I need is, is an opportunity to dance. Hey, 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 Daniel. Listen, why don't you just keep your mind out of the dustbin hmm? and tell her how you feel? I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Well, she'll probably just give you a slap and you end up in the hospital or in the mortuary. I bet we hear what? Get your ass back to work. Because the way I hear it, they are trying to outsource some departments. And if we don't perform, we'll find ourselves scanning Murphy's bits of food. You'd sooner outsource the MD's department than marketing communications. Who'd write all the proposals? Uh, speaking of which, Honorme, have you finished the bid for the Lagos Street Project? I have got those and I have got those. For the woman and for the young guy who sells. Oh, just the person I needed to see. Hey, Mas, please go get us some paper from the next office. I'm just coming, you know. Eh? You have not even allowed me to arrive. You are pressing me and putting me on accelerator. Why now? Eh? So you don't want me to have. Oh my God! Hmm. The feeling of this cool. Is that why you came in here to feel cool? Eh? Look, I will always be cool. AC or no AC? Jealousy? Can you drop it? What is wrong with you? Who are you going to do what they asked you to do? Eh? Oh, 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 you people are ganging up against me. Is it because of the fact that you, you, you are graduates? We just want one degree per each. Huh? Look, when I'm just through with my whole school, I will not just have one one degree. I will have a, a degree in circle, a full circle degree, 360 degrees. And you think I don't know my rights? Huh? You, think, you think I don't know my, my, my fundamental human rights from my left? Huh? You, you, you think I don't know? Look, let me tell you something. It is in the constitution of this office that some chapter 5, there's 2. There's, you, 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 you should not just talk to someone. Talk to talk. Ah. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, I know. You think I don't know? Amos, will you just go get the paper you want me to report you to Zara? <laughs> See, this is my cousin. We are, see, she's my cousin. No? Eh? If you did not know, this is Family business. She said I can come in here and do anything I like, anyhow I want. Eh? In fact, you call her Madame Zara. Me, we in the house, we call her Zaza. Anyhow, really. Down. Can you please take a seat so I can call her? Hold on, my please, hold on. Please, but let me let her know you're around. I'm sorry, ma. I tried to stop her, but she. It's okay, Petra. You should let these girls know who is who around here. Do you understand? I can't see my friend. I can't talk to my friend when I want to. What's with that? Nana, you don't understand. This is an office. They're just doing their job. Mm -hmm. Anyhow, how are you doing? Okay, you look rather hot. What's the occasion? We're going for dinner at the opium, remember? And people always put dress up, you know, to go there. Dress up or dress little? Little. You know, little packages like to say. But seriously, do we really have to go? Honestly, I'm tired. I just want to go home and sleep. Please. No way. This is important. The food is uh, out of this world. And the chef, Indonesian, he comes from a lineage of, you know, great chefs and they just go on and on and on. Fine, we'll go for dinner. Rather go and eat than have your rants. At least you've accepted. But I have to finish something quickly if you don't mind.
Help yourself to the fridge. You don't have my usual now, do you? Then we'll wait till we get to the restaurant. Then let's leave now, then. So how is the Prince Charming? Still as charming as ever. Giving his sugar all the loving in the world. Who do you think your are teenagers are being? Well, that's because of how we feel, darling. You should fall in love someday. It's the most beautiful thing. <sighs> Please spare me. Don't even start. Hello? Yes? Are you serious? Sure, I'll come. Right away. I've got to go. Why? What happened? Jerry's mother's been Jerry's grandmother's been in an accident. Oh. My God, is she alright? Let me come with you. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Enjoy your dinner, okay? I'll ask the driver to pick you up later. <sighs> what am I supposed to eat by myself? Trust me, don't worry about that. Hello, did you forget something or can I come? What? Tell me this is set up. Hello, Angel. It must be Zara Williams. Yes, and you are Onikoi. Bernard Onikoi. It's a familiar name. Quite a large family. I am the son, first son of my father. Not only did I inherit my father's good looks, but also his multi-million dollar empire. So I'm looking for a lovely lady to share this with. And your friend suggested you. So I'm here to find out how right or wrong she is. Would you like to order? Oh yes, I would hope for Cristal, but this is not my choice of a restaurant, even though Tina said... Tena is her name. Oh yes, Tena. Yeah, she said they actually serve good food here, even though that's... This place is a little beneath me. I have exquisite taste, you see. Oh no, not to worry. In no time, I will rub off on you. Excuse me? Oh, yes, my darling. See, when I finish with a woman, I usually leave her unrecognizable. I call it the Onikoi time on touch. Uh, yes. So, what about you? Um, why don't you go first? Oh, uh, um, Crystal, please. No, sir. We don't have that. Just as I expected. All right, then get me monkey cocotini, please. Um, it's monkey cocotini. Oh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, you got that? No, sir, I'm sorry. We don't have that, too. Then please, can you at least get me pineapple juice? Yes, sir. Is it freshly squeezed to room temperature and prepared under extreme hygienic conditions? Yes, sir. Get me a glass then. Yes, sir. So, my delectable angel, tell me, what do you do? I work in a consulting firm. Great! You see, the Onikoyis actually do have one. In fact, we have major lines of businesses. <laughs> Perhaps we could uh, hire you. I promise we'll pay you better than you actually are earning right now. I pay myself well enough, thank you. I own the firm I work for. Really? <laughs> That's even better. We'll buy you over. Yeah. Oh yes, we, the Onikoyis, we only go for the best, and you do look like someone who knows our onions. Hmm? Did you see today's punch? Ah, oh, women. 
You're only interested in gossip magazines. <laughs> well, we actually are, you know, producing uh, generating plant that will produce nothing less than 10,000 megawatts of energy. <laughs> Nigeria's problems of energy crisis is actually going to be solved. And who's the brain behind all this? None other than Bernard Onigui. You see, the plan is to have this generating plant in every single state. Wait, what, what state are you from? Uh, what? Sorry to cut you, but I need to use the bathroom quickly. I will be back shortly. How about you drink? Uh, You know, I could kill you, I swear. How dare you do that to me, Tena? Babe, the food never done. I'm kidding, you walk, but I'm doing the job. Well, we can't keep our dear friend Zara company and even make an sumptuous meal. From her limited resources in her kitchen. Sarah, you don't even have a frying pan. I had to fry eggs with a pot. You don't even have proper red wine glasses. Haven't you heard the little saying about the way to a man's heart? First of all, you are too lazy to find proper wine glasses. And you, who said I care about the way to a man's heart? Hey, come on, Sarah. I apologized. You know, he's my friend's brother, and I didn't know. That guy came highly recommended, though. Mm, she was the kind of friends you keep. Now leave me with this man Palava now. Leave me alone. Why is it so hard? Well, it's because we care so much about you. We love you and you have to take care of that thing. What thing? Now, you know what I mean now. <laughs> My dear, I'm not the one you should be worried about. Me? I can get laid whenever I choose. Whereas, in the hair is bound by law to a man we never see. Whatever, Zara. It's not your business. And really, you should stop making this about me because it's about you. And wrongly so. Look, honey, I'm worried about you. You know, you're starting to look sex star. Ha <laughs> ha. <laughs> Very funny. Look, it takes a sex star woman to know another. <laughs> You and I are no longer on the same boat, darling, because I got me some last night. Oh no, you didn't. Are you serious? Well, after your guy almost bored me to tears with his I want to save Nigeria speech, I was frustrated, so um, I decided to get high and late, and I did. This is hot! Ugh. So tell us, how did it go? <laughs> so you believe me? I leave such crazy behavior to that was a yarn. Look, when I'm ready, I will find me a man. When I'm ready. Now lie. That is a mistake most women make, and I will not let you do the same. You will find a man now. Because if you wait till when you're ready, all the men will be finished. Now pray. And then the world will be a better place. My God, a world without men. I can't wait. Okay, there's this thing called RNG. You know someone who knows someone who knows someone and you guys hook up. That is how I met my oh, husband. Oh, need don't talk about this thing. What? Don't, not, not let me try for here. I have told you time without number. You do not have a marriage. All you have is a certificate. Hey. So I'll leave it. Talk to the bling because the ears don't hear you right now. Do I look like I'm complaining? Look, I'm perfectly okay with the arrangement, so butt out. Okay, all right, sorry. But really, you guys, I understand that you're trying to help. And moreover, I understand that this is more about you than it's about me. Because you're probably scared that we might drift apart if I'm the only single one left in the group. Um, okay, you know what? Just this last time. The guy's nice. You will like him. We will never bother you again. 
just this last time. <laughs> Aren't you guys listening to any words? He's my neighbor's friend and he's rich. He he was hard just like you. Tena, Tena and I have met him and he's nice. So where do you guys find these men? Honestly, can I just go there and shop for myself? Unless not the garage. Sarah, this one last time. If it doesn't click, then we'd give up forever. Something for the baldy. <laughs> you know, just keep it warm and nice. <laughs> Last time. You guys can see such a man and think he's my type is beyond me. The guy has money. Forget about his weight. He's rich. So am I. Look, the man has to have the money. Forget about what people tell you. Look at my husband. I hardly see him, but who cares? As long as I see his cash, I have his name, I'm happy. Society is happy. Inita yeah. is not just cold, it's sick. Look, I don't care what you people say. I do this for love, all right? No half measures. I'm either in or out. Oh, oh yes. Mm, yeah. It's okay to love, darling. But you forget that you're no longer a spring chicken. All I ask is, get a man. A rich one. And knock him up to your taste. Exactly. Brush him up. That's oh. what everyone is doing. Okay? Mm, thank you. You people have married good-looking men. It's me that will beat my own to my taste. Wait a <laughs> Sarah, do you know how many frogs I kissed before one turned into a prince? Well, that is you. I'm done kissing frogs. Even princes. God forbid that you will not marry. Her. Sarah, if it's the last thing I do, I will find you a husband. Okay, I find a husband, I marry. Mm -hmm, what happens? Then at 44, he dies. See your friend now. Hey, hey, look at you. <laughs> do you know how much money the guy has left her? As I'm talking to you now, the girl is rolling in money. Wait, she, she's also mourning. Emma. <laughs> Look at you. Huh. Anyway, um, both of you, aren't you a bit uh, overdressed for a wake up? <laughs> now make it the man. See you. I beg you. What am I wearing? What am I wearing? Is it not black? Do you know the names of the people on the guest list? It's either we're there or we're there. Please, please, go and dress up. Let's go. You're here talking about bereavement. Dress up. Please, please, just get up and go and get dressed because make champagne not will leave me. Or maybe that's where you find your own husband now. We don't know. Yeah, not for me. It's not me and you. Yeah. I, I said touch wood now. Oh. Sarah. Oh. See, if you guys want to buy private jet now, now she'll buy it I'm already and you have to leave. Um, I will leave as soon as I'm done with this budget for banking first. No, it's okay. I could help you finish it. The ball is for seven and radio report says there's horrible traffic on the Zumba Badi Oh, the Valentine's ball. Oh my God. Today's the 14th. I completely forgot. Okay, that means I must leave. I must leave. But, um, all right. Please make sure that that document is on Mercury's table. Oh, at the end of the day and then let Daniel take note of the points I made and make the changes um, yeah that should be it okay I gave you that document earlier right okay all right all right all right, all right I'll see you all right bye
Tana, what's up? Okay, well, you're in luck. I got work for you. I need a date ASAP. No, I'm not joking. Like right now. <laughs> you're kidding. You can organize somebody in no time. Uh -huh. Okay, anyhow, but please make sure it's not any monkey looking person with bad breath. I can't take that one. Alright, let him know it's formal wear with a touch of red. Okay? Alrighty. Alright, talk to you later. He'll be with you real soon. Thanks, love. I knew I could count on you. Okay, let me rush and press for time. You can give me the juicy details later. Don't hold your breath. Thank you so much. I'm Sarah. Oh, Tyrone. Nice to meet you. Now, I hope my friend explained everything to you. It's no big deal, just a Valentine's boy. It's just that it would be weird if I showed up alone. So I hope you don't mind. Okay, so let me just a second. Did you come in the car? No. It's fine, I will just see mine. Yes, it's a beautiful day. Oh, yeah. Oh, what can I say? Oh, yeah. Yes, it's a beautiful day. Oh, what can I say? Yes, it's a beautiful day. Wake up in the morning, it's a brand new day. Oh, what can I say? I'm a Very nice, very nice. Well done. Thank you very much. But the credit uh, goes to my wife, not to me. Ah, <laughs> really? Nicely done. Glad I came. <laughs> yes. You can notice I came early. Yes. Chief, as regards the contract, now what we're bringing to the table is very invaluable. Sarah. You take life too seriously. Just enough. It's a night of fun. You know what? You want the contract? You got the contract. Huh? Plenty of food and drink. Great. Oh, that's fantastic. Thank you. I'll see you brother date. Ah, yes, yes. Um, Tyrone, please meet Chief yeah. and Mrs. Ekene. Tyrone. 
So, lots of food, lots of drinks. Yes, I think I'll start with the drinks. <laughs> um, that's good music. You know what? You grab a drink and we hit the dance floor. <laughs> Hello. Hello, right back at you. Did you have a good night? Yes, I did. You? I'll have a better one tonight if you have lunch with me. Uh, I don't know. It's a Saturday uh, and... Is that a yes? No, I didn't say... Okay, I'll take that as a yes. So we'll pick you up at 3 o'clock. <laughs> A little too self-assured, don't you think? 
Tyrone. Expect me. Bye. I like this place. It's very... Private. I know. That's why I like it here. It makes me think. I like peace and quiet. Me too. What is it you say you do again? Well, I... I ride. You ride? And I play football. <laughs> Very funny. Okay, I asked for your profession, not your hobbies. Come on. What? Oh, I'm sorry, it's nothing really. No, tell me, what? Well, honestly, I was taken aback by your beauty. You're a very beautiful woman. I'm not just talking about physical beauty. Do you know the most attractive part of a woman? What is it? Her brain. I find her very attractive. And I want to know you more. Cheers. Cheers. sunshine and rain and scents and stars smells and sweet thoughts and memories of golden thoughts colors words that keep me awake Pick up your phone. Pick up your phone. Yes? Let him in.
Don't tell me to go to Tabby Walk. Hi. Hi. Are you happy to see me? I, I could always leave you. Oh, no, of course not. Don't be silly. Please, sit down. I think it's a question of whether I like to or not. I just don't have the time. I'm too busy with work. <laughs> you don't have the time to eat? No, to cook. If I want to eat, I order in or eat out. You know what? I'm going to cook for you. You cook? <laughs> okay. When? But tomorrow. I can't pick you up, we go get food stuff. We come here and cook for you. I have a better idea. Why don't I come over to yours and you cook for me then? That way I know where you live. Now is there a problem? No, there's no problem. <laughs> you have a girl stashed somewhere? <laughs> no, 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 nothing like that. No, no, no. Okay. You want it at my place, it's at my place. So tomorrow, my place. Good. Yeah. I'll come by from work. Okay. My place. Uh. I told you guys, or you wouldn't listen. Now, what have you got? A broken heart which Daniel would never have given to you. Stop it, Daniel. Stop it. How can you be making fun of someone who is obviously in pain? Oh, self inflicted pain ain't no fault of Danny. She needs money. Oh, her landlord will throw her out. You know, she just buried her father and they spent lots of money on funeral arrangements and all that. Is that why she's so sad? Oh, come on, cheer up, Alame. You're in luck, okay? Listen. You have no place to stay, okay? And Daniel has a two bedroom apartment. Aren't you lucky? When are you moving in, baby? Daniel, stop it! It's not funny! It's not funny. Seriously, I, I think you should go and ask her for a loan. Hmm? We'll see. But you know I can't. I'll run up with my head in a lion's den and go to that woman's office. Wait, hold it. I was not thinking about it. Look, I don't stay in a face me, I face you, Paru Paru, if that's what you think. Honestly, I don't think it will hurt you to try. Just try. Rosie, I can't. Look, I can't look at that woman in the face. How much more? Ask her for money. What happens if she decides to sack me? Huh? Just for asking for a loan. <laughs> Come on. No, listen, I know she's a piece of work. But I still believe she might have her heart. The worst that can happen is she just scream, scream at you. What did you so long? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know, I was so busy. Hey, 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 wait, 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 wait. Um, how's the queen today? I mean, did she say anything about me? I mean, I, I passed her in the corridor this morning and she winked at me when she thought I wasn't looking. Are you serious? Yeah. You know, there's a thin line between confidence and delusion. Get lost. I don't know how you guys cope with this boy. No, no. What's wrong? What's wrong with you? She needs money. She, she, she needs money for her rent. I suggested she ask her, but she won't listen. Um, <laughs> but uh, she, uh, yes. um, I, I don't have money. But she, you know you're my favorite in the office. Yeah, uh, I know. Okay, how about if you go to Zara's office for me and um, help me ask her for some money? Mm -hmm. My dear, that is a wrong request because I cannot. Eh? But you're my darling still, but I can't. Go and try. Thank you. Hmm? You just, just try. Or would you rather leave it, Daniel? Yeah, it's better. Hell no. Um, hold my bag. I'm going to try. 
What, what's it was You guys don't. wait for me. I'll be right back. Just, All right, relax, just compose yourself because <laughs> in fact, I don't envy you right now. Uh, hey, what's up with her living with you? Okay? Living, living with you. Okay. You want free, free living. You should be ashamed of yourself. Listen, no, I, you, I, you, I don't you don't want to only living with. Yes, how may I help you? I um I I just oh God, she said you wanted to see me. I don't recall requesting for you. Well, then it must have been a mistake, ma. Sorry, ma. Anna may I help you? You do realize this company operates on a personal basis? Yes, I do, ma. Sarah. What do you want? Um nothing, ma. Thank you. You had better speak or forever hold your peace. Uh, well, well, Ma, you see, it's just that um, my rent has expired and my landlord is threatening to throw me out and I don't know where to get the money from and things are just... So you need from. money? Yes, Ma. How much? Um, 200,000 Ma. And the HR is saying that they're not going to give out loans anymore. So I don't Three hundred thousand naira for me. Oh, <laughs> thank you, ma. I mean, Zara. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, ma. I will pay you back every cobble. I promise. It's not alone. It's for you. Go back to work. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> oh, thank you, ma. Thank you. Anna May. Finger. I am a boss right now. That's how God will do his things. Yeah. Like that. Like the chief of the ladder. Let's go. What's up? Uh, no training. No training. You have to leave the apartment now. I need it. If you drive me out of my own place, I'm not driving you out of my own place. I'm picking her up in an hour and during that time, I mean, she's mine and your apartment is mine. Okay? T.Y. I can see you found yourself a rich one, huh? I mean, first you bore my car, now you want to take over the whole apartment. Uh, dude, why are you trying so hard to impress this chick? I mean, it wouldn't matter if she finds out that you are not paid. Bros, it will matter! Then it's fake. Leave her alone. Who's this chick anyway? Zara Williams. I should leave her. Uh, Zara Williams? Uh-huh. Wait. Zara Williams of Akinto and Williams Consulting. How many Zara Williamses are there? Boy, are you mad? Are you out of your mind? These people are filthy rich men. And, dude, I'm not just talking about new money, man. I'm talking about old money, class, status. What were you thinking? <laughs> what am I thinking? Yeah, what were you thinking? Yeah, what were you thinking? What are you saying? That I'm not good enough for her. That's what you're saying. 
Come on. You know that's not where I'm coming from now. Uh -uh. But come. How, how did you guys meet? Uh, how did you guys meet? Now you want to know the story. Fate did. brought us together. What? How am I supposed to go out, man? Considering you've possessed all my worldly possessions. Where am I supposed to go? You're the rich one. You can pick a taxi and check into a hotel or something. Go to an ex-girlfriend. Yes. Go to an ex-girlfriend. You are mad. You are very mad. Get out from here. You know, I could have let you off the hook. I bet you're tired from work. For you, Zara, I will do anything. That's it. Frames. Nothing. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Just a picture frame. Yeah. And music. You know it's yes. make me dance, are you? Sixteen. No. I can't dance myself. Just a little step. Two to the left, two to the right. <laughs> Nothing else. So you are going to make me dance. No. Just, just relax. Whilst we wait for the food. You must have used this spell on me. I don't even date. <laughs> I hope this spell never wears off. This did. <laughs> Sorry, I have to take this. Something. I'll call you back. You were saying? I wasn't saying anything. Um, <clears throat> I think the food is really burning this time. The food is burning. <laughs> Thank you. 
Good morning, ma. Good morning. Good morning. Where is Onome? Um, oh, she, she's gone to the bank. Hey, wake up. Oh my god, did you see that? She smiled at me. She smiled at me. <laughs> did you see that? She has a beautiful set of teeth and those lips. Mm, mm, mm. Wait till I grab them and bite them and kiss them. Points of correction. She smiled at both of us and not just you. You? Are you kidding me? She didn't even look at you. You know, I must finally be winning her over. Zara smiled. Zara, who never smiles, she smiled at me. Daniel, uh, there is a meeting for 11 a.m. this morning. Have you drawn the list of agenda for that meeting? You're such a poor job, you know? But nothing can change the taste of sweet victory in my mouth. <laughs> I know you're jealous. You're jealous because Zara is tripping for me. Oh, I understand, okay? You know what? I'm going to her office and I'm going to declare my love for her. <laughs> She's going to fall like a pack of cards for me. <laughs> No, Dana, seriously, now I am convinced that you have gone stuck raving bananas. Come on. You're just jealous. You're just jealous. You're jealous. <laughs> she smiled at me. Oh, God. She smiled at me. <laughs> I think she's in love with me. <laughs> Yo, T.Y. Yeah? You know, I was thinking, man, dating this chick might not be such a bad idea. You think so? Of course I think so. Do you think it's going to work? It better work. At least you get to move out of my house and then I get my privacy back. Impossible. I'll never tell I'm living with you. How is this now supposed to work now? Uh-uh. Dude, how long do you think you can keep playing this charade, man? How, do you, how long do you think she's going to keep falling for all your crap? Do you think I'm going to be here forever? I know you're not. That is what you're saying. Listen, my club is going to call me back and reinstate me. And Amen. then I'm going to come back on top. Fine. And the top man is who she's going to know, not this one. Do you understand? T.Y. Okay. T.Y. really. Honestly, I really, really want to believe you. Really, I do. But let's be real, man. These things take time, time man. They do. I mean, let's say you're cleared of all your charges. Your club reinstates you. What about your, 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 your frozen accounts? Then the backlog of the salary. Dude, it's gonna take time before it's disbursed, man. So come on, let's be real. T.Y. T.Y. Mm -hmm. Are you sure you're not just gonna admit to that? You know, you know what I'm talking about? Admit to what? Mm -hmm. I don't know what you're talking about. Ebuka, you of all people, if no one trusts me, at least you should trust me. I... How many times did I drop in your hand? I didn't touch that girl. I didn't touch her. She framed me, it was a setup. Do you understand? The lawyers are working on it, it's just a matter of time. This nightmare will be over. Yes, I know, but chill, man. Sorry. You know, are you, bad guy. In the meantime, you are closing up with Miss Moneybag. T.Y., seriously. I think she's way out of the league, bro. I don't care what you're saying. You can discourage me all you want. I'm not listening to nothing. I told you I love her and I think she loves me too. It's not funny. I, I can just see the headlines, man. Society girls are Williams in love with suspended foreign ex-footballer. <laughs> Wake up, bro. See, I know Iberia was a bad choice, but she's your girl, man. Ibuka, hey, don't you ever mention Iberia in the same breath as Zara. They're two different people. There's no comprising to make. There's no... They're two different people. Uh, uh, and I didn't change Zara. Yeah. Destiny brought us together. Destiny. Get out from here, let's go. Destiny brought you brought, brought, brought you all together. <laughs> Why are you running away from me? Why you should be running to me? Ebiri, what do you want? You. All I want is you. 
Is that too much to ask? I want my boyfriend back. Correction. Your ex-boyfriend, now get that through your thick skull. Do you understand? It is over and done with. Read my lips. Over and done with. You can go to Ralph. I give you both my blessing. Tell him. I said I'm sorry. What more do you want from me? Ralph was a mistake. A mirage that will never happen again. A mirage that will never happen again. Ebiere, after you cheat on me with my ex-manager, you expect me to take you back. Are you all right? Whose work permit took you to Holland in the first place? And why didn't he file for you when you stay expired? Tell me. Baby, I told you. Raph is a rat. I bet he even ratted on me in the first place. You know what? You both suit yourself so much. As I give you my blessing, go to him. Baby. Why are you killing me with these words? Why do you have to dredge up the past? I told you yesterday's news. You know I can't live without you, baby. You know, I, you're my heart. You know you're my Don't you even dare. Tyron! Slip without your touch. Can't live without your love. It's hurting inside. Can't breathe without your love. I'm lost without your touch. Helpless without your love. I can't breathe without your love It's hurting inside Can't breathe without your love How's your husband? Oh, he's fine. He went to Luxembourg yesterday. He called me this morning. He's missing me, I hope. Ajala, what can we do love? Ini. Yep. Something fishy is going on with Sarah. I don't want to talk about Sarah right now. I call her and she wants to hang up with me. She's eager to hang up the phone. And each time I speak with her, she's absent-minded. Something's amiss. I guess she's busy. You know how Sarah is. She's always busy with her work. And it so is busy. not. It isn't. We have to get to the bottom of this one. Want a briefing? No. <clears throat> uh, thank you. But it's not my birthday. Why are you giving this to me? I... I just wanted you to know that uh, you're a very special person. Yes. And it's been my greatest pleasure to work and uh, even to be in the same room with you is... Darling. Did she get my email message? Yes, I did. That was so twisted. How are you doing? I didn't even know that a woman doesn't even like me. I'm telling you, I went. So. Amos, everybody doesn't like you. That's not a big deal. This is false, man. You don't like she hates me. She hates me even more than the both of you joined together. You understand? I just went. In that bike. Ahem! Ahem! Tony boy, what's up? Hmm? How did it go? So, 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 tell us, is Zara in love with you yet? I am so sure you gave her that you're done with special art. Please, make him move. Who wants to wait for a kick at him? Hey! See, there's something 
you wait now. <laughs> See, that, Danny boy, eh? There is a very big difference, though, eh? Between stiletto and palm slippers. Can you imagine? Common salary earner like you, you just want to carry as as and do pew. emotionally, because sir. Emotionally, because sir. <laughs> you must let me warn you. Don't let me transform my aggression on you, okay? Look, let me tell you, eh? Where it is, where, where, where I come from, it is called in my heart. In my fear. You want to see hot, eh? Just see hot. Then come and sit down and tell us about it. There's light at the end of the tunnel. Okay, darling, spill the beans. Aren't you tired of keeping us in the dark? What beans? Don't give me that innocent look. You know it's not going to... I'm not going to go with that. Who is he? Mm. Must everything be about him, man? Yeah. The look in your eyes. The bounce in your feet. That's not from stocks or bonds or whatever it is you do in your office. Yes. Recruitment and HR consult. Whatever, darling. In it. Put smart for this matter. Aren't you tired of seeing your friend so evasive? It's a man, of course. I mean, what else? To do this to a friendship of over 20 years. Point of correction. A friendship that spans 7 to 10 years. I am officially 25. <laughs> you shot your 21 and I'm 16. So tell me, babes. Who is he? You guys are so nosy. It's yeah, yeah. So tell, 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 tell. Oh, yeah. Alright, yeah. okay, you're right. It's a guy. Happy? Bingo. I knew it. What guy? The same one from the Valentine's Ball. <gasps> no way. Tony. It clicked. You whistle. How come you never mentioned it? Because I wanted to be sure first. I mean, I didn't want to jinx it from past experience. And to think you guys met at the Valentine's Ball. Wow. That is so cliche. I knew it. I knew my connect would work eventually. Trust me. We're too much now. We're too much. I mean, we should just start this new dating agency and call it Arrangey? No, 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 no. Arranges. You are who? Me and you, of course. So, girl, tell us how was in the sack? Huh? What? Come, come, don't even give me that holier than that attitude because I know what you did last night. <laughs> We're waiting. Alright, if you must know, I'll give him. 9.5 over 10. <gasps> Go, Tony! Go, Tony! You didn't do anything now, did you? Why? Because no man is 9.5 over 10. Now that's a fact. Well, no, sweetie, I didn't. I'm not you. You're not who? Ho, ho. I beg. If it's Tony that I know, he takes down his prey. Why do you call him Tony, by the way? I call him Tyrone. Is that a nickname? My friend. What is the Ashwibi going to be like? I'm thinking black and gold. You yeah, are who is wearing black at whose wedding? Please don't even go there. That's this season's colors. Ahem, what do you think? Okay, maybe burgundy. Fair white dresses. Prada bags. And gold ghillie. That's the first, but you know what? It might work. Let's just, you know what? We'll keep it within us just strictly for friends of the bride. What's bright? <laughs> Look guys, I just met the guy, you're already planning my wedding, come on. Mm -hmm. So, um... Okay, maybe just burgundy dresses, Prada bags, Jimmy Choo's, no gilly. Are you listening to me at all? Hello? Tell me how now? How have you been? I'm fine, I'm fine. What have you been up to lately? <laughs> naughty, naughty. What do you mean now for you? What's wrong with you? 
She told me you guys have been seeing now. Uh-uh. What are you? You know, that's not. Okay, you know what, right? Just wait for me in your office. I'm coming to you now. Okay? Just wait. Alright, love. See you. So it's like to me again. Oof. Tony, I don't get it. I don't understand why Zara would lie to me. Perhaps she just wants me to get off her back. Or, <clears throat> Zara must See, be true. And I really like this girl. I do. I thought this Zara arrangement thing was a done deal. Oh, baby, why the slack? Why the slack? <laughs> I have to get back to you on that. I really don't know. I have to get back to you on that. I'll call you, all right? All right? Why would I lie to you? Oh, Jenna? stop <laughs> it. Stop it, Zara. You said you were meant to attend the Valentine Ball with Tony. Did you go with him? I did. <laughs> I attended it with him. What more do you want from me? Did you attend it? Look, he showed up. We went to the ball. We had a blast. And we've been having fun ever since. He's such a wonderful, romantic. Why am I explaining myself to you? Why would you explain yourself to me? The guy bugs my phone like he's running mental and telling me how elusive you've been. Well, have you considered that maybe Tyrone does not want you in his business? His name is Tony. Tony Lowell. What's with this Tyrone business? It's Tyrone. Ha! You know what? After lunch, we're going straight to Tony's office. Uh, my dear, I'm sorry. I have to work. I'm sorry. Man business is serious business. <sighs> you. You don't have boyfriend, it's a problem. You have boyfriend, it's a problem. Okay. <laughs> Look at where you're going to now. Uh-uh. Don't harass my driver, please. Wake up in the morning, it's a brand new day. Oh, what can I say? I'm a desperate rider and I'm on my way. Yes, it's a beautiful day. Oh, what can I say? Yes, it's a beautiful day. Oh, what can I say? Yes, it's a beautiful day. What's wrong with it? What's wrong? What's wrong with you? You look like you've seen a girl, sir. What's wrong with you? Nothing, let's go. Say Tyrone, please. I'm sorry, there's no Tyrone here. Tyrone is in there, or wherever he is. Can I just speak to him? Sorry, there's no Tyrone. This is in Tyrone's house. Hey, what's going on? Whoa. Hey. Hi. Good evening. Yeah. I'm Zara William. I know. Okay. Can I speak to Tyrone? Does he live here? Uh, yeah. Uh, but he's um. Actually, um, not back from work. Work, yeah. Work. Thank you. So, what's up? A dispatch rider? You must be kidding me. And I'm guessing this isn't really your house now, is it? It's not what you think. What you can explain, Tyrone? If that in itself is your real name? That is my name. 
and I didn't lie to you. No, you just didn't tell me the truth, which is pretty much the same thing. I was going to when I came to your house the first day when Mr. Lawal sent me with a message. You were too much in a hurry. Yeah, and, and since then, all this time, I don't remember you falling over yourself with explanations. Rather, you grabbed an opportunity with both hands and just went on to mislead me. You stupid Jokada messenger. Dispatch writer. Whatever! Calm down, sorry. Calm down. Try and understand. If you really knew what I do, would you have taken a second look at me? That is not the point, and you know it. You lied to me, and that in itself is inexcusable. Okay, yes, I... I misled you a little. A little? <laughs> but baby, it, it really doesn't change the way I feel about you. Don't touch me with those filthy paws of yours. God, I'm so disgusted. Zara, don't! You are nothing but a cheap, low-life, stupid fraudster! And I hate you! I hope you and your Okada rot in hell for eternity! Just get out of my way! I don't ever want to see you again! Hey man, guess you didn't like the new landlord, huh? to forget her, man. Come on. Why do you think I'm drinking? Hmm? Drinking so I can forget her. So now I got myself into this mess in the first place. Upside down. You always want things I can have. I want my club to reinstate me. I want him to unfreeze my account. I was out, uh, but she's not even making. So they didn't know what's happening. He's like, bro, bro, man, you're my boy. You know, you're good at what you do, man. Trust me. I'm assuring you, your club is going to call you back. You're going to get paid every single back knob salary. Yeah. Trust me, man. It's TY, man. It's TY. Uh, Ginger, man. And as for Zara, just see, forget Zara, man. Her case is dead and buried. Bro, there's no need drinking yourself to death over a dead issue. Come on, man. Let's go, man. Let's go. Yeah. Trust me, man. It's TY, man. It's TY. One last glass. One last glass and then we go. Hey. 
Amen. Darling, it's good to see you. What do you want? Well, you know, we are meant for each other. You can't run away from me now, you know now. Ibiere. Ibiere. Yes, darling. Just tell me what you want. Anything at all, just tell me. If it is money, tell me how much. I'm going to give it to you so you can leave me alone, please. I don't want your money. <laughs> Not that you have any. I just want you. And what Ibire wants, Ibire gets. I love you, Tyrone. You know that. Eh? Leave me! You love me. You should have been thinking about that when you're opening your legs for Ralph and manager. Come to think of it. You guys actually set me up just to get me out of the picture, isn't it? We did not set you up. Ralph is not like that. Oh, listen to yourself. We didn't set you up. Ralph is not like that. You were standing here for him as well. Get out of my sight. Hey, come back here. Come back here. Is it because I've been playing with you since? I've been doing it at the bottom for you. Is it because I've been doing it at the bottom for you? Now I'm going to show you the true color of the South House. Look at this deportee. <laughs> You're not even happy that a girl like me, look at me, sexy thing like this, follow you this proper. You want to follow this girl, Abby? Where you will eat and you will clean your mouth. <laughs> I be rare in this town. By the time I finish with the both of you, even Panabita will not be able to arrange your face. Rubbish people, not safe! I don't have time for you. By the time I finish with you this time, you will see how I'm going to finish with you this time. Don't worry, you don't worry! Foolish thing! Look at you, fight for nothing! Fool! Fool! Oh no, she boy!
helpless without your love. I can't breathe without your love. It's hurting inside. Can't breathe without your love. Zara, quit the PT party and join the rest of humanity. So cute. Aww. Sarah, I can just imagine the two of you. You perched behind him, riding away to a perfect honeymoon. Oh, what a love story. Look, if this was not so serious, I'd be laughing too. I mean, Zara, you should, you know, you'd get over him, never mind, okay? I know the exact solution to a heartbreak. I'll get you a cut here, bag, okay? You know, you might want to add a sports jersey to that too. It's just perfect for Makada ride. Man U, Chelsea, Arsenal. Oh, you can stop just it and leave Man U out of it while you're at it. Don't worry, darling. Thank God at least we found out. On time, we discovered. You never know. You'll get over him, okay, love? This one that she's pining away like this. Trust me, she's not going to get over it. Huh? <laughs> I won't be surprised if they get back together. Despite his Okada status, his name is Tyrone. And what if we do get back together? Sarah, do you understand the implications of what you're saying? Just imagine bringing him along to a wedding and people see us together. Oh my goodness. How do we explain that, Sarah? And I will just die if he passes me on his Okada and he waves to me. What will I tell people? For God's sake, Amy, he's a dispatch rider, not a criminal. And you forget, he was once a football star, but he had problems. What? What sort of problems? Was he on drugs? Sweetheart, all we are saying is that people like Tyrone should only date people like Tyrone. I mean, you of all people shouldn't be saying that. I mean, a few years ago, you had nothing, okay? You were once a people like Tyrone. Ouch. No, seriously, until you married your husband for money and be. Zara, I will not have you insult me. And I will not have you insult my boyfriend, okay? You married your husband for money. I dated Tyrone for love, to each his own. Uh, John, who did you tell us to give for me? Hello, madam. Uh, how may I help you? Do I look like your Lagos speaker? Why are you speaking big, 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 big grammar for me? Yeah. Uh, Excuse I... me, do I know you? <laughs> hey, Babo. Tyron, you don't know Ibere. Do you know Ibere? John, who's this girl? <laughs> oh she should God. be your wife now. She should define you. Huh? She should be your wife. She should define you. My wife. John, I beg you, I never married you, and you know it. This is one of those shower for one night girls going from office to office causing commotion with two uh, married people and all that. You better take it out of here before a guy comes to see you. You'll be in trouble. You know it. Why do I come to you with you? Take it out now. Me for one night. Me prostitute. No, oh, do I? By the time I finish with you this time, eh? Oh my god. Let us be too small for you. Foolish boy, because of that girl. Eh, don't be so. I bet, I bet, wait back at my back. I bet, I bet, back at my back. Oh, I'm not done with you yet, though. I am not done with you yet. Foolish boy. told me you hanged out with your friends here on Saturdays, remember? What you want? Can I see? No? Why are we doing this to ourselves, Zara? Was it so terrible that you can't forgive me? Just 
These are the best times of my life, were the only times I spent with you, and that's the truth. You were everything for me, Zara. I just don't want you to take this happiness away from me, please. Tired. Zara, please don't say it. Don't. Don't even think it. What is this about, really? Yes. Is this about the lie or is it about the truth? Which is it? Is it about the fact that I lied to you? Or is it about the fact that you can't face... You can't face the truth about my status? How dare you insult me? And you have no right whatsoever to judge me. Just... Shh. Fine. Yes, maybe if our initial meeting had been with you on your bike, I would not take a second look at you. But neither would you if I were a girl on the streets cleaning. That's life. Okay, people of the same class stick together. But you and I were, were thrown together by chance, by fate. And I thought we made something special out of it. We did, Sandra. You were not wrong. We shared something, and we still do. I just want you to give us another chance. Just one more chance, Sarah. Please. Zara, no. Zara. Tell me you don't love me anymore. And I will leave. I will leave. And never come back. I never said I loved you, did I? Hey. You look nice. You didn't say the party was for three? Um, Tanya, Tana, you know Tyrone. Did you order any drinks? Tana? What? If he knew he was buying, we should at least have gotten a cheaper restaurant. So at least he could buy water. Shut up, Tena. Don't speak of him like that. Of him? Or it? Tyrone. <laughs> Tena, whether you like it or not, I still care for that man. At least show some respect. You think that both of you are good to each other or will be good together, don't you? The rat, that got a rat. Can't make it. And the frog, darling, will never be Prince Charming. You know what, Tenna? I think you should keep your stupid, shallow opinions to yourself and mind your damn business for once. <laughs> Sorry. She didn't mean any of it. You're right, darling. This thing is not gonna work. I've never been so humiliated in my life. I, I feel so embarrassed. I'm sorry, but try and understand. Look, Tana is a very nice girl. It's just the disparity between us is too much. Yes, I know. She was right about one thing. Maybe it's about time we took a, a reality check. 
No. I just had a reality check. I mean, this whole disparity between us is getting in the way and it doesn't make sense. I see that now. I'm tired, Zara. I'm tired of fighting. I'm tired of trying to live up to everyone's expectations. I'm a disappointment to everyone, including myself. I have a career going down the drain. And here I am, running errands for people. And to top it all, I'm in love with a girl I can't even have. How do you think I'm going to feel this? So what if, if you don't have a career in football? So, so what if you ride a bike and run errands? So what? All that can change, but... One thing I know that won't change is how I feel. And and what's in here? I love you. Sleep without your touch. Can't live without your love. It's hurting inside. Can't breathe without your love. I'm lost without your touch. Helpless without your. I can't breathe without your love It's hurting inside Can't breathe without your love Oh, this crazy feeling Take it all
I'm lost without your touch. Helpless without your love. What's that? I can't breathe without your love. It's hurting. Hello. I believe you must be Zara. <laughs> Anyways, I just came to thank you for all you've been doing for us. God will bless you immensely. And you are <laughs> Ipiere, Tyrone's fiance. Funny, you didn't tell her about us. <laughs> Anyways, I just came to warn you like woman to woman. You see this thing you and Tyrone are having? It's not gonna go anywhere. Tyrone and I have done our traditional wedding. The money you've been giving him is gonna be for our white wedding. At least finally we're going to do it. So I advise you to keep off my man. Ebiere? I'm sorry, is this some kind of joke? Joke? Hey, <laughs> let's leave this out of before you. Ebiere, it's about time you leave yeah. now. I'm very sorry. This is Ebiere. Eh? It's not gonna go anywhere. I will just advise you like a woman to me. This one is taken. Find your own. That's enough. As for you, you will come and meet me in the hotel. Useless boy, Chikunu. I'm very sorry about this. Sarah. What are you doing here? Are you insane? And you went ahead and told us such blatant lies. Because you are mine, and I intend to keep it that way. Oh my goodness. What misfortune befell me to meet you in the first place? Since I met you, it's been bad luck one after the other. You have not started seeing bad luck yet. Yes, our pastor said it. Any man that will use a woman and dump her without marrying her, God will punish him 1,000 over. Back to sender, and listen to me. If I see you 100 meters close to me, I swear I will kill you. Did you hear me, you slut? If I see you close to me and Zara, I am telling you I swear I will kill you. Did you hear me? Get your filthy hands off me. Get your hands off me. If you ever in your life try that again, I swear to God, you will not know the other side of midnight. Do you hear me? You know what? I'm not even worth it. I am. I've been wasting my time. Good luck to both of you. I am sick and tired of this. What the hell? What am I doing here? Gosh! Bad people! Aproko! Hi! You're not even happy that I've been. I've been putting up with your defects. Look at this loser. Oh, bad rubbish. Good readers to bad rubbish. <laughs> I wanted so much for me to work. I knew it was doomed from the very start. It's better now than never. I'll get you another man in no time. It's not just about any man, it's about this man. I love him. What's there to love about him? Everything. Everything. He's the most beautiful, loving, caring person I've ever met. I mean, inside and out. And where does that leave me? Go 
one laugh, laugh. Cheer up. <laughs> Sarah, please, you need to listen to me. We need to talk. You have nothing to do. Sarah, we do. You just have to listen to me, Sarah. Please understand, Sarah. She's just a lunatic. I had a misfortune. You're dating. We are not married. But you're sleeping with her. I am not sleeping with her. Why else would she act so erratic? Sarah, I dated her for a while. We broke up six months ago. Okay? She knows I'm with you. She was jealous. She came there to create a scene. Didn't you realize it? Zara. Zara, look at me. Trust me. And the rape? I was framed, Zara. I didn't do it. You have to trust me. It's just a matter of time. I, my lawyers are getting to the bottom of the case and my name is soon going to be cleared. Sarah, we have enough issues. This is not even an issue. That's this exactly my point. You have... We have too many issues. <laughs> Sarah. Sarah, you need to trust me in this. Trust you? You lied to me before. Why should I believe you now? Zara, we can get past that, okay? We get past this and then some other drama springs up. You know what? I'm, I'm tired. I, I don't think I can do this anymore. Meaning? Meaning? I give you my heart. I give you my love, my trust. What do I get to return? Lies, deceit, humiliation. I mean, seriously. Do you know how you make me feel? Look, in public. Do you? So this is what this is about. Image? Your image? Zara? Have you ever thought about my insecurities? No, never. It's all about you. It has to be about you, no matter what, right? It's the way you look in the, in the midst of people. It's the way you are around your friends. It's the way people look at you. Sarah, I am sick and tired of this whole class act. You know what? From now on, you can handle it yourself. Let it be you. Let it be all about you. And you were right. You were right about one thing. We do have too many issues. Where'd you come? Yes. 
Go and um, continue with the meeting. You worked on a presentation, so you should be fine. But, but ma'am... Just do it. I just wanted to come see how or have a feel of the cool of this place. Amos, thank you. That will be all. You can go. Hmm? You're making me very uncomfortable. Go. What's wrong with you now? Ah, what, 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 what's wrong? You made me shout in this office. What's your own? Eh? Why do you people hate me like this so much? What have I really done? Why do you hate me like this? Eh? I just came in here, I didn't do anything. After all, I was asked, uh, say, I can come in here anytime and, 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 and feel free. Oh, yes. So how uncomfortable will you be? When now, I, I, I find my, my, my certificate and just file it in. And before you know it, I'll have a permanent desk in this office. Or don't you know that I'm a graduate of uh, engineering? Amos, get out of here. What is it? Get out of here. Which stupid certificate? Eh? I'm sure you don't even know what the uniform of a secondary school looks like. How much more a university? Sometimes I wonder who even taught you English. Just leave this person, this is our job. Can you imagine? See, if it is this one, I can understand. But you, this corporate termites, can you imagine? Look, I just know the antidote for you. Look, one shirt does, it's like it's Fiam, you are just dead. Can you imagine? You are challenging me in this office. Hey, Amos, yeah. me. Yes. Corporate termites. Yes, corporate termites. I said it. I repeat it again. Oh, in this office. office. Wait, wait. Who are you? That my desk should be limited. Who are you? I thought your cousin was Yes. 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 No, now his exercise I was doing. You know, guys, I'm not running. What was I running from Yes, who's, who's there? <laughs> Baby girl, so. <what's> <laughs> oh, see. How are you doing now? <sighs> I'm fine. Uh, it's not that you're looking so dressed up. Where are you off to? My dear, I won't go see a like that, sir. Uh, okay. Hey, how far with that matter now? Which matter is that? The Tyrone matter now. Oh, oh, so now that's what I carry you go. No, sir. So you carry this your two left leg, walk off all the way from your house, carry come here for Tyrone matter. <laughs> that's what your ears catch you reach. Of course not. <laughs> yes. Biri, please, do you still have that your red dress? I mean, the one with stones around the neck. Mm -hmm. Yes. You do. Oh. I better bring it in. I, I'd like to borrow it for one party that is happening this weekend. Borrow? Faye? You want to borrow my dress? So, upon all the men where they follow for this Lagos, you don't get money to take arrange yourself dress. You want to borrow my dress? Come and collect the dress. Wait, wait. Ibiri? Is it because of this common dress? I mean, this common dress. You're not calling me an Asha. You never seen insult yet. You hear me so? You better go find one of those your customer. Maybe for arrange money for you, you go see money chop. You won't borrow dress. Nonsense. <laughs> I knew it. Look at you. No wonder Tyron left you and ran away for his dear life. Eh? Okay. They said you go. What did I worry you? They said you go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Carry yourself. Carry your two left legs. Like, I can't take off. Carry your waka. I said you go. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Because if I start with you, 
Foreign-based Nigerian footballer Tyron Wagu has been reinstated into his Dutch club Tantas FC. It will be remembered that Tyron. Continue reading. At least, my friend, he will buy you lunch. <laughs> Okay. Do I see? <clears throat> Listen, Zara, I just think you should go and look for this man instead of sitting down here and finding a way. Huh? Yeah, why not? Okay, Tina. Coming from you, that is bothersome. What is so bothersome about that? If this man was still a papa, you and I wouldn't even be having this conversation. Anyway. <laughs> I, I can't. Why? Because it's been over three weeks and he hasn't tried to call or contact me. Who knows? Maybe he's over me. Then go look for him. I can't. Why not? Because... Because... Because he'll think now he's made money, you're coming back to him? Well, yeah. Even better. At least now he can afford to buy you all the things you normally wear. And buy you lunch too. So now come on, don't be insensitive. Alright, darling. Truth be told, you are obviously in love with this man. I have never seen you like this. You should go and look for your man. Zara Williams, mm -hmm. please sign. I'm gonna have never been more careful. Oh. 
my goodness. There's Sarah. There's Sarah. Oh, look at oh, she's looking so beautiful. Them. You, on the other hand, you never liked his dots. Look at this weasel. When did you start supporting them? Oh, what can I say? I'm a desperate 